Hello everyone, my name is Dominono and welcome back to Mass Effect. So, we've got to go back to the tower to go tell the council that hey, turns out Saren is super a traitor and you guys are all dumb. Me, More or less. Could you spare a moment of your time? I guess I can. Under Shepherd. My name is Samesh Patia. Forgive the intrusion, but I have nowhere else to turn. What, what do you need? My wife was a marine. She was in the 212 on Eden Prime. I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me for cremation, but the military has refused my request. Why did they refuse your request? There's got to be some reason. Hmm. I don't know. All I know is that they have declared it impossible for my wife to be returned to me. We'll look into it. The man in hmm. charge of my case is Mr. Bosker. When I last saw him, he was in the expensive bar over there. Not I that. The time. I just want to give my wife a proper funeral and the respect she deserves. I suppose so. Bar over here, huh? This way. Yeah. Talk to what's my calling over here. And be like, hey, give the man back his dead lady. Seriously, like, what's the matter? Did you fucking misplace her? Did you accidentally send her to the garbage chute instead of the cremation room? My goodness, you're Commander Shepard. Why does everybody know who I am? Quite a briefing in the diplomatic corps. Is there something I can do to assist you? Stop you stealing the corpses. Tape for a grieving husband. I want you to release the body of Nerali Bacha. Commander, nothing would make me happier. I'm afraid, though, that it's not quite that simple. Why? Since Nerali Bhatia died on Eden Prime, as mm -hmm. Mr. Bhatia no doubt told you. Her wounds are inconsistent with any type of weapon damage we've seen before. That is why her body is being held. I don't care how badly the Geth mangled the body. It's the husband's right to claim her. Yeah. We are not holding Nerali Bhatia's body out of discretion. We are, mm. frankly, holding the body for research. Right, the that's lovely. we're conducting may lead to better defenses against Geth attacks. Respectfully, Serviceman Bhatia may save more lives in death than she did in life. Mm. You've got How many bodies? A lot of bodies? Can't you release one? Very few bodies had this new type of weapon damage, and very few were in good enough condition to study. Beyond that, Commander, we need as many bodies as we can to get a reasonable sample size. If very few of them had it, then it stands to reason very few Geth use those weapons. Therefore, you know fuck you. I am. If I want Nerali Bacha, I can get her. Commander, I, I don't think threats are necessary. Evidently, they are. Body were here on the Citadel. Would you really risk going in shooting to get it? You yes. said you'd been briefed on me. How do you think I feel about people mistreating the dead? Mm. All right, Commander. You win. It was hard enough refusing Mr. Bhatia. I'm not going to risk an incident by refusing you. Damn Skippy or not, Commander Shepard. Back to Earth. I'll go now to see to it myself. Good job. And sort out your hair when you're at it. That weird shave thing is goofy looking. Hey, Smash, I threatened the guy a whole bunch and slammed him into a locker like a fucking high school bully. So he said, okay, fine. So we're good now. Give me your credits. <laughs> oh, Shepard is a douche. Hello again, Commander. Has there been any word? Your wife is coming home, Mr. Batya. Thank hmm. you. I will return home and begin my preparations. It does not bring me happiness, but it may bring me peace. Goodbye, Commander. I guess sometimes that's all you can ask for, really. Sick. Alright then. Rapid transit. Can we rapid transit to the tower? That would be handy. Presidium. That sounds important. Tower. Sick. Loading screens. So yeah, for the most part, renegade or neutral shepherd. This shepherd is unfriendly. I do like the fast travel though. Thank fuck. Hey Captain Anderson, Come how you on. doing? Is presenting the Quarian's evidence to the council. Sick. He didn't Prime Prime go away from victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You wanted proof? There it is. Yeah, seriously. This evidence <laughs> is irrefutable, Ambassador. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status, and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. Good. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. No. Matriarch Benezia. She must be working with the Geth, too. 
Matriarch Venezia is a powerful biotic, and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. Mm -hmm. I'm more interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? Only what was extracted from the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Protheans. Then they vanished. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the Not likely, is the but you know. Bringing them back. Saren's searching for it. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Do uh -huh. you know what this conduit is? Who cares? Saren thinks he can bring back the Reapers. That's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy? Impossible. It has to be. Where Why does it have to be? Go? Why did they vanish? How mm -hmm. come we found no trace of their existence? If they were real, we'd have found something. Seriously? They killed the guys who, like... Well, supposedly, they killed the guys who built all of the technology that you utilize en masse in the universe, like right now. Like, you think you'd have found something? If they just killed all of the people, left all the stuff behind, and then fucked off, you think you'd figure it out? All I right. tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Yeah, seriously. Don't make the same mistake again. This is different. Mm. You proved Saren betrayed the Council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. The eh. Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saren's true purpose. A legend he is using to bend the Geth to his will. Uh huh. 50,000 years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilization. If Saren finds the conduit, it will happen again. Yeah, seriously, what do you think actually Saren happened to the Protheans in that case? For his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. You think you that guys can just control everything, enough. don't you? You know he's hiding somewhere in the Traverse. Send your fleet in! A fleet cannot track down one man. A citadel fleet could secure the entire region, keep the Geth from attacking any more of our colonies. Or it could trigger a war with the Terminus systems. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. I can, I can let Saren me go down. then. The commander's right. There is a way to stop Saren that doesn't require fleets or armies. Exactly. No, I'm gonna go in there and punch his face. Humanity is not ready for the responsibilities that come with joining the Spectres. It was a Fucking Turian Spectre who betrayed like. this council, and it was a human who exposed him. I've earned this. Yeah, I'll say. Nerd. Mm hmm. Commander Shepard, step forward. I like how none of them have names. They're just race counselor. Suddenly there's a crowd. Where did you all come from again? You're just hanging around and then suddenly something important seemed to happen. It is the decision of the council that you be granted all the powers and privileges of the special tactics and reconnaissance branch of the Citadel. Fuck yeah. Spectres are not trained. But chosen. Individuals forged in the fire of service and battle. Those whose actions elevate them above the rank and file. You can tell he's given this speech before, don't you? Symbol. The embodiment of courage, determination, and self-reliance. They are the right hand of the council. Instruments of our will. Spectres bear a great burden. They are protectors of galactic peace. Both our first and last line of defense. The safety of the galaxy is theirs to uphold. Maybe you should consider putting you in extra lines. Inspector, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. Yeah, seriously. I've been ready for this since Eden Prime. We're sending you into the Traverse after Saren. He's a fugitive from justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate him. I'll find All right, then. This meeting of the Council is adjourned. Hey, we're a Spectre. That's a cool name. I'll probably do a better job than you. We've got a lot of work to do, Shepard. You're going to need a ship, a crew, supplies. You mm -hmm. get access to special equipment and training. You should go down to the CSEC Academy and speak to the Spectre Requisitions Officer. Anderson, come with me. I'll need your help to set all this up. All right, calm down. Just <laughs> shouting at him. Pardon my fish face. I thought the ambassador would be a little more grateful. He didn't even thank you. What do you yeah. expect from a politician? Come on, right behind you, Shepard. Way, Spectre training, charm, and intimidate burn and sunlocked. 
Did I level up there? I think I did. Let's have a look. Way four points. Spectre training. Damage and duration of all your powers and attacks. Health, maximum accuracy. Regenerate extra accuracy a second. Eh. It's not bad. Uh, let's take this up. Motivated by. Eh. Max that out so I can intimidate everybody in the universe. Warp. When can I unlock this? Like, do I need extra points, maybe? It straight up doesn't say, does it? Does it? Am I dumb? Oh, there we go. You unlock it by leveling up throw. Well, you know what? I like lift, so let's move towards that. Garrus, you, or you auto-upgrade. And so, well, you auto-upgrade, that's fine. That's cool, just do that. Uh, and armor plating. Huh. Is that more impressive than the shields? Uh, that's the one that I use. Damage protection. Plus 45 shit now. I like the shields better. Plus, I can buff my shields. Right then. So, I actually need to go speak to the ambassador in the docking bay. Access through CSEC Academy. Fine. That's where the Spectre Requisitions Officer is, so maybe we should have a look and see if we can invest in anything cool. If I remember accurately, though, those things are bloody expensive. Uh, is that on the wards? Yeah, it is. CSEC. Caesarean section. Seriously, like, how did they not notice that they called it fucking C section? Where is the requisition office? Over there. Is that the same as the. Whoops. Fucking. Alright, calm down. Is that the same as the. Um, oh, I can set my destination to. Trap. Fucking stop doing that. Yeah, so. Bang. Alright. It, it only says one requisition office, so I assume that this includes Spectre stuff. Yo, I'm a Spectre. Give me cool shit. One sec. Looking you up. Cool. What does it say? Does it say I'm awesome? Commander Shepard, Fucking take Earth your time. Military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? Yes. Who wants to know? Just checking for CSEC records. I can only sell goods to authorized personnel. Spectre so, authorization. Okay, today, check Commander it. Shepard. Show me what you've got. Sounds good. Just let me set you up. Oh, this must be a mistake. What's that? The system's telling me to offer you our select stock. Spectre. Well, I heard about that, but I didn't realize it was you. Sorry, Commander. Just yeah. show me what you've got. Yeah, I'll seriously. The Get to the point. Commander. Enjoy. Thanks. Fucking, yeah. Seriously expensive. I've got two grand. This costs like 37k for the Stinger 6 pistol. Still, like, what's the difference? Fucking almost 60 dam. Well, yeah, 60 damage, essentially. Your pistols are all fucking irrelevant. I don't care. Heavy armor, light armor. That armor's actually pretty much worse than my current one. Medium, heavy. There, yeah, they've got like no. The heavy ones have got like big damage and solid shields, but no tech or biotic resistance. But I guess I can do that anyway. Reaper sniper rivals. And. Turian armor, Krogan armor. Human armor again. Biotic amps. I use biotic amps, so can I? What is this? Aldrin Labs license? What does that do? I don't know, but it's only a hundred, and it says it will give stuff to my quartermaster on the Normandy. So can I buy that? Thank you. Uh, grenade upgrade. That's only two hundred, but yeah, fuck it, I'll buy that as well. Haven't used the grenades too much, but hey ho. So yeah, that might give me access to biotic amps later. Although they don't seem to be any different at all. Pistol. Yeah. What can I sell? Can I sell some shit? Anti-personnel rounds. It's worth 14. Plus I'm doubling my sell value, so... Yeah, I'm gonna mess with this stuff and we'll cut to relevant things. Alright, so I sold pretty much everything. And, uh... Still couldn't buy anything because everything's super fucking expensive. So fuck it. Maybe we'll get some cool shit later. Hey nerds. I've got big news for you, Shepard. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the Normandy. The ship is yours now. Huh. 
She's quick and quiet, and you know the crew. Perfect ship for a Spectre. Feed her well, Commander. This isn't right. The mm. Normandy belongs to you. You needed your own ship. A Spectre can't answer to anyone but the Council. And it's time for me to step down. Fine. What kind of leads do we have? Saren's gone. Don't even try to find him. But we know what he's after. Isn't that what I'm supposed Hunter. to be doing? He's got his Geth scouring the Traverse looking for clues. Uh -huh. We had reports of Geth in the Pharaoh system shortly before our colony there dropped out of contact. And there have been sightings around Noveria. Right. Find out what Saren was after on Pharaohs and Noveria. Maybe you can figure out where the conduit is before he does. Anything okay. else? We have one more lead. Matriarch Benezia, the other voice in that recording. She has a daughter, a scientist who specializes in the Protheans. How convenient. We don't know if she's involved, but it might be a good idea to try and find her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. Mm -hmm. We have reports she was exploring an archaeological dig on one of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau Cluster. Well, Sounds let's start like that. for the Artemis Tau Cluster. It's your decision, Commander. You're a Spectre now. You don't answer to us. Fine. Your actions still reflect on humanity as a whole. You make a mess and I get stuck cleaning it up. Yeah, I'll well, take care of Sarah. If I can you deal take care with of it. the political fallout. Not exactly the answer I was looking for, Shepard. Remember, you were a human long before you were a specter. Hmm. I have a meeting to get to. Captain Anderson can answer any questions you might have. Great, thanks. Joe and I. Do I have any questions? No. Thanks, Keith David. Bye, Keith David. See you later, Keith David. Fucking trot on. Lay me in. I want to do cool stuff. Stand by, shore party. We have to load the <laughs> decontamination. I heard what happened to Captain Anderson. Survives a hundred battles and then gets taken down by backroom politics. No, that's always the so way though, isn't it? Commander. Things go bad on this mission. You're next on their chopping block. So yeah, I suppose. There somewhere, and we're gonna find him. With our weird eyes. Ships behind you, Commander. Hundred percent. Intercom's open. You got anything you want to say to the crew? Now's the time. Yeah, fucking. Let's keep this short. I don't give a shit. Crew, this is Commander Shepard. We have our orders. Find Saren before he finds the conduit. None of the other species has the guts, grit, or balls to deal with this. Boy, do they not. So it's up to us. We're the only ones who can stop Saren. I swear to you all, we will stop him. Nice speech. Well said, Commander. Captain will be proud. Yeah, well, the captain's not here. I'm in charge now, Joker, and time's wasting. Get this bird in the air. Yes, sir. Fucking A. Yeah, I can look outside. No, I can't. Just codex entries. Fine. How interesting can they possibly be to read? That's not the right button. Neither is that. What the fuck is the right button? I don't know. Let's just pick it up from here. So the codex is full of tutorials, personal history, shit like this. Blah blah blah. That's that. Fifty marines died on a goose. Fine. Ships and vehicles, humanity and the alliance. There's a whole bunch of stuff in the codex if you're interested in looking at that. But I have things to do. We could go somewhere, or we could go talk to the noobs downstairs. What's in here? Oh, this is the stairs. Fucking sick. Fine then. Let's go talk to everybody. Everybody's pretty cool. Well, except like Ashley and Kate and they're dull as shit, but hey -o. Well, speaking of dull as shit. Hey, my locker. What's in here? Pistols, assault rifles, and a sniper rifle. Eh. Fucking why not? Maybe I'll give them to the guys I bring on my next trip. Chakwas? No, you're irrelevant. Where is everybody? It's been too long, I can't remember. Sleeper pods, fine. Nope, there's nothing over here. More shit for the codex and a bit of XP. Cool people, where are you? People I like talking to. Personnel manual. More codex shit, fucking hell. I'm already lost on my own dumb ship. They're probably all like downstairs again. Hanging out in the cargo bay. Activate. More elevators. Even on my ship, I can't get away from slow-ass elevators. Really, you have to load the cargo bay? Gosh, I'm sure we could handle it. Fucking video games. Hey, Garrus. 
Sick. Who's around here? Down here, I think, should be Rex. And no, Rex isn't here. Rex is probably out there somewhere. But Tali's here in the engine room. Hey, and our engine room looks cool. Element Zero, cool. Hey, Tali, you're cool. That makes two of us. I can't believe you were able to fit it into a ship this small. You'd be surprised what I can fit in small spaces. I'm starting to understand why you humans have been so successful. I had no idea Alliance vessels were so advanced. Well, normally they're not. Cutting edge technology. A month ago, I was patching a makeshift fuel line into a converted tug ship in the flotilla. Now, I'm sitting on board one of the most advanced vessels in Citadel space. Lucky you. I have to thank you again for bringing me along. Traveling on a vessel like this is a dream come true for me. Oh? I had no idea you found ship technology so interesting. Yeah, seriously. It comes with being a quarian. The migrant fleet is the key to the survival of my people. Uh -huh. Ships are our most valuable resource. Hmm. But we don't have anything like this. We make do with cast-offs and second-hand equipment. We just try to keep them running for as long as we can. Yeah, that's fair enough, I suppose. vessels date all the way back to our original flight from the Geth. 300 year old. Fleet still using ships that are three centuries old. That's pretty out of date, Dali. They are constantly being repaired, modified, and refitted. They aren't pretty, but they work. Mostly. <laughs> We've tried to make ourselves as independent as possible on the flotilla. Grow our own food, mine, and process our own fuel. Hmm. But some things we just can't make on our own. A patch to maintain the hull integrity requires raw materials we just don't have. That's why our pilgrimages are so important. I see. Now we could learn more about the quarians, the geth, the pilgrimage, but we've got other I people to go. talk to. I should go. You probably will. You're cool. I like you. Unlike Caden, who was fucking boring. Hey, requisition hey, officer. Looking for some extra supplies before you head out? What have yeah, you got? let's have a look. Whatever you want. Armor, weapons, mods. It's not standard alliance issue, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. Mm-hmm. Well, as long as you don't mind paying for it. Why should I pay you for my weapons and armor? Yeah, seriously. My stuff doesn't come from the alliance. I have to purchase it myself, and it's not cheap. You're an alliance no, requisition officer. The alone have set me back more than I'd like. But no licenses, no goods. Without the goods, I'm out of a job. Let's God see damn what it. you've got. You bet. Fucking cheap ass space bastards. Heavy armor, medium armor. This stuff's pretty expensive. Pistols are alright. Even if, well, that one's pretty much weaker than my current one, so who cares? Ooh, meta gel upgrade. I should buy that. That would be handy. Everything else is pretty irrelevant. Fine. Fucking nerds. Garrus, you're awesome. I knew working with Oh. Have you worked with a Spectre before? Well, no, but I know what they're like. Spectres make their own rules. You're free to handle things your way. But see, mm. Sec, you're buried by rules. The damn bureaucrats are always on your back. I Being bet a they Spectre are. does have its advantages. Exactly my point. Like no one can make fun of my face. Suspect, it shouldn't matter how I do it, as long as I do it. Yeah. But see, Sec wants it done their way. Protocol and procedure come first. That's why I left. Fair enough. So you just quit because you didn't like the way they do things? Hmm. There's more to it than that. It didn't start out bad, but as I rose in ranks, I got saddled with more and more red tape. The c sex handling of Saren was typical. I just couldn't take it anymore. I hate me. You did the right thing. Yeah, well. Life's too short to sit around waiting for things to happen. It is. You gotta do stuff. Make things happen. Way, do things. And without c -Sec Meaningful speech brought to you by Dom Corp. Is to that. Well, you're free to go about your business as you see fit. Thank you, Commander. Hell yeah. Hey, the Mako. Wish they kept that in Mass Effect too. Oh, I can equip everyone from here. That's interesting. Garrus, you like sniper rifles? Is this better? Less accuracy, but better damage. So, fuck yeah, take that. Uh, and I believe Tali uses a shotgun mostly, but I don't have one of those. So, hmm. Rex, what do you tend to use? Probably also the shotgun, to be honest, but I give you this assault rifle instead. Or I could just give it to Garrus, actually, because he's probably not 
like as a NPC he's probably not super used to going for the sniper rifle so fuck it yeah have the assault rifle as well Ashley commander what's your opinion on what's the up mission? I wish you got there sooner, Commander. Yeah, well. I appreciate the rescue. I just wish... They died, you live. That happens in this job. Pretty much. Commander, believe me, I understand that. If I had been more alert, we wouldn't have been cut down by an ambush. Well, then be more alert. Plain enough to me. Be more alert. Aye, aye, Commander. I'll Excellent. I'll make sure it doesn't happen again. This man, Chief. Sir. I'm not sure if you're... Oh, hey, Rex is down here. I'm not sure if you're supposed to say dismissed if you're the one leaving, to be honest. Nice ship you got, Shepard. What whatever. can I do for you? Personal What's inquiry. Story, Rex? There's no story. Everyone's a story. Go ask the Quarian if you want stories. Yeah, come on. You've probably lived for centuries. Don't tell Sick. me you haven't had a few interesting adventures. Well, there was this one time the Turians almost wiped out our entire race. That was fun. They had the same with us, but we fought them off. Yeah. It's not the same. Seems similar enough to me. So your people were infected with a genetic mutation? Oh. An infection that makes only a few in a thousand children survive birth? Well. And I suppose it's destroying your entire species? I suppose it isn't all the same. I guess so. I don't expect you to understand, but don't compare humanity's fate with the Krogan. Okay. Sorry, Rex. I wasn't trying to get you upset. Your ignorance doesn't upset me, Shepard. All right, Jesus. As for the Krogan, I gave up on them long ago. No? The genophage infected us, but it's not what's killing us. What can you tell me about the genophage? That's fairly interesting. Ask the Solarians if you want details. They made it. Oh. All I know, it makes breeding nearly impossible. Thousands die in stillbirth, and most never get that far. That's fucking rough. Every Krogan is infected. Every one. And no one's rushing to find a cure. Why don't the Krogan try to find a cure? Hmm. When was the last time you saw a Krogan scientist? Um. Ask a Krogan. Would he rather find a cure for the genophage or fight for credits? He'll choose fighting every time. It's just who we are, Shepard. I can't change that. Nobody can. Eh, I guess that's fair enough. Are your people really dying? You is who you is. We're sure not getting any stronger. Too spread out. None of us are interested in staying in our own system. Uh huh. Lots of species have left their homes and prospered. But they go to colonize new worlds. We're not settlers. We're warriors. We want to fight. Krogan are essentially the Klingons of Mass Effect. Hire ourselves out. And most of us never go back. Fair enough. So long, Rex. See you, Rex. Shepard. Well, I talked to Tally, I talked to Garrus, I talked to Ashley briefly, I talked to Rex. Fine, I think we can go somewhere else. Behold, my beautiful face. <laughs> it, uh, it's weird how it's dented in there. Oh well. I mentioned before that editing the faces of these kind of things, I like to just change them up slightly. But when you change the angle that you're looking at on them, they always turn into ridiculousness. Like just sculpting with a three-year-old. Hey Presley, what's up? If anyone anything? has to take over for Captain Anderson, I'm glad it's you. I'm not sure about having non-humans on our ship, though. They're I'm cooler sure than any of our guys. I decide if we have non-humans on this vessel. Hmm. Yes, sir. Understood, sir. Good. Carry on, Presley. Yes, sir. Fucking don't talk shit about the cool people. They're like, hey, we'll help you, and I'm like, yeah, you're badass. Look at my regular guys. They're fucking trash. Fucking Jenkins. Huh. Supposedly constructed by the Longsting Protheans, this colossal deep space station serves as the capital of the Citadel Council. Gravity is simulated through rotation. There's a comfortable 1.2 standard G's on the wards and a light 0.3 standard G's on the Presidium ring. Total length, gross weight, population, riveting. Who gives a shit? Alright, where are we going? Somewhere else, I guess? Let's zoom out a bit more, shall we? 
Wait, where the fuck am I supposed to be going? Hmm. I have no idea. Zoom out further. Oh, there we go. Novaria, the Aras dig site in Artemis Tau, Pharos. And there's a whole bunch of other shit that we could go take a look at. Because Mass Effect 1 was big on exploration. Well, sort of. Sparta, Macedon, Athens, Gnosis. I don't think we know which one she's at yet. Fuck it, let's go to Macedon. As in Macedonia, presumably. We'll start there and if I can figure it out when we arrive. How hard can it be, right? In your own time, Normandy. Space Kamehameha's. Those relays look cool. Right. Here in Macedon. Adveg. Orlin. Australia. Somewhere around here. Can we scan this shit? Survey. I don't think that's what we want. Can I see where we are supposed to be going here? Probably. Finally, are it is Sony. Explore the Uncharted Worlds and find her. Well, fine, we've got to have a look by ourselves, I guess. It would have been nice if I could have accessed the journal from the map. Fucking, I, I don't know. I don't think. Let's have a look. Second most challenging of plants. Most interesting. Liquid ammonia sea. I bet that place fucking stinks. Zoom out. What else you got? Fucking, let's have a look at Fargaloos. Bloody weird name. Gas giants. Can we survey this? Large concentration of xenon. Amazing. Is that helpful to us? Um. Cherilia. Level 1 pressure hazard. Very dense atmosphere of ammonia and oxygen. Sense of silicon based oxygen breathing ecology. Avers are discouraged. Anything? We could land here, but that doesn't seem conducive to actually finding to Sony. Enormous terrestrial planet? Surveyed. Matriarch's writings as I'm scanning the planet when a strange signal came from orbit. Now we get a press to determine the signal was from an ancient beacon. Your salvage team brought the beacon aboard and found one of the Matriarch Dilanaga's writings in its storage compartment. Great. Cool. What does that mean? Anything? I mm, fucking, I don't know. Go to Athens. Landing seems like a bad idea. I imagine that there would be a... It's been too long. I can't remember if there is, but there should be like some kind of alarm thing before telling us if we're actually at um, the right place or not. Nausicaa, eh. I'm pretty sure that's a planet in Star Trek. Survey this place. Gas deposit, helium-3, I'm great, that's great. Fucking Proteus, that sounds helpful. Like the Hana homeworld, Proteus has more than 90% oceanic cover. Incredible heat raises global humidity to 100%, creates constant cloud cover and powers colossal typhoons range across the surface year round. Sick. Free oxygen. Fucking, again, wonderful. But is that helpful in any way, shape, or form? Pharos, what about you? Cursor examination, my nightmare probed. Jurian insignia recovered. Scans of the planet revealed on the planet. Based on its moon, the recon team found nothing of interest, but much of the debris was marked with the Magna Colony insignia. Cool, I guess. But, again, fucking, is there anything here useful? Did I have a look at Salamis? Salamis? I think I did. Hmm. Okay, Gnosis. Let's try you. Fucking scanning. Faced us. To be fair, I suppose this is probably a lot of what being commander of a starship is like. Hey look, copious amounts of nothing. Thin atmosphere of Krypton. Ugh, fucking hell. Cut to Liara to Sony. Almost immediately, this seems promising. Therum, rich industrial world, humans, lions. Uh, many Prothean ruins. That sounds like a place where we'd find a Prothean scientist. Well, a scientist who studies Protheans. Tally, Garrus, come with, because you're cool and everybody else is lame. Well, Rex is awesome, but Caden and Ashley suck. I don't even care. You would fucking throw both of them in a the liquid fat. Hey, fuck yeah, the Mako. I like the Mako. Gets a bad rep. Yeah, it's like a tank, and it's got jet boosters.
fuck yeah. This thing handles overly sensitively, but I think it's cool. I like it a bunch. Alright, fucking calm down. Doesn't handle ideally, but it's fun. And it can jump. When was the last time you had an old an ATV troop transport that could jump? Was it never? Was it the last time you were playing this? Probably. Oh. How did you play this, out of curiosity? Did you play Paragon or Renegade? Most of my guy, like, all, when I was playing by myself, like, pretty much all of my dudes were Paragon. But Renegade makes for more interesting, more interesting conflict and just lets me sk <laughs> skip talking to most people. Commander Shepard is a jerk. So far, so rocky and lava. Rocky and Bullwinkle. Um, now, this should be the right place. It's a fucking long trip, though. Oh, it looks like I'm seeing hostiles on my radar. Oh, hello. That sounds important. It also sounds like... Oh, God. It was right over me. Say hi to a Geth ship. Geth armature. Fuck you. I have rockets and shit. What have you got? Nothing. Just slow-moving energy bullshit. I have fucking heavy cannons on this motherfucker. Yeah, fucking wrecked. What now, huh? Nerds. Fucking nothing, that's what. Right then. Actually, though, if I can level up, I might as well. I can unlock lift. Sick. And then I can use it. Awesome. If you com I remember that if you combine, at least in uh, two, if you combine your biotic powers, like it amplifies the damage and some such. Looks like a lot of hostile in that radar. Death Armatures, do you want to talk? Do you want to talk about my lord and saviour, Mako Cannon? Oh, hello. Oh, there's a rocket. Towers. What happened to your voice, Tally? <laughs> Why did you become, like, a three-year-old girl? Death Heavy Turrets. Nah, fuck it, I can avoid you. I, your missiles are slow as shit. And mine hits immediately. You guys should consider, like, upgrading these things. Eh. Side window, huh? Um. Trying to knock down the front door does seem stupid. But, can we find a side window? Probably. Oh, yeah. There's, it looks like there's a convenient path around this. Oh, fucking hell, pardon my sick wheelies. Path around here. Easy. Easy. No trouble at all. There's a turret around the corner. I can see it on the map. Yep, there it is. I see you. You suck. You, you didn't even shoot me. You're rubbish. Oh, fucking hell. Calm down, Mako. Fucking, I said calm down. Jesus. Jump over that. Sick. Looks like a whole bunch of geth in here. Geth juggernauts. Fucking ruined. Oh. Ow, ow. Fucking... They shoot missiles too, which is fine, I guess. Still. Geth troopers ain't shit. To heavy weapons. <laughs> Knocked him over with the gun. Anyone else? Hmm? Anybody? You're in there, I can see you. I can see you on the radar. Fucking, can I hit you from here? No, maybe not. Hello? I know you're in there somewhere. Does the explosion hit you through the wall? No, maybe not. I'm sure I can get out of this somehow. Yeah, Q. Sick. Just straight in, straight out. Fucking awesome. Oh, I could put my, uh... Let's put lift on two, and we'll put warp on three. I don't know who's in here, but... No point in risking it. Lift. Space. Throw. <laughs> you suck. Ooh, lockers. Yeah, you think we're good? Is that your professional opinion? Another pistol, sniper rifle, some light armor. What's that armor like? Oh, fucking hell, we recovered a whole bunch of shit. Motorized joints, first aid interface, high caliber barrels. Goodness. Calm down, gents. Better damage, but a little less shields. Uh, no, I like the shields more. Grenade launcher? No, that's fine. 
Actually, what about the first aid interface? Plus health regeneration per second? Eh, it's not a lot though, is it? Nah, I'm sure we'll manage somehow. Don't suppose you'd have it in you to sprint, like, by yourself? No, just gonna go for a hearty jog? Fine. There's another one over there, I'm sure there was. Yeah, if you landed here, I'd probably have kept searching too, to be honest. There's one... looks like it's in here somewhere. Can I hit you again? No. Yeah. I want to have a look in case there's anything useful in here. Not super important, but... Fucking... I need goodies. Give me your goodies. Get the shock trooper. Ow, Jesus Christ. That was fucking shocking, alright? Fucking lift. Fucking got caught on the shield. Figures. Oh, but you're melted now. More decryptions. Simple. Shotgun and a sniper rifle. Fine. I'm sure they're fine. Fine. It's all fine. Everything is fine. Tally, why are you, like, constantly stuck on the maker? Whatever. Right, which way are we going? This way, I guess. So, that way, I guess. Um, how do we get around there? Back up this way, maybe? Hmm. I'm not sure. Is that, like, a ledge, like, just around here? Can I go over this? Possibly. But, that is the way I'm supposed to be going, isn't it? Yeah. Huh. Can I... Oh. Hello. Oh, no, no, no. It's just a weird look. Can I... Open this door somehow, perhaps? Oh, bloody hell. Sick ramps. Actually, maybe I can open it from inside somehow. It's worth a look, right? Use your brain. Yeah. Yeah, maybe? Up here? Door controls, perhaps? No, it's fucking nothing. That's helpful. Dali, open the door with your sick tech skills. No, nothing? Fine. Garrus, are you stuck on the Mako now? God damn it. You guys are not very smart. But then I'm currently being outwitted by a door, so I guess I've got no room to talk. Door, please, open. This was just the weapons locker, but yeah, there was gate controls. Fuck's sake, should have looked around. Oh well, better late than never, I suppose. Garrus, you get unstuck and then restuck? Fine. Ah, should have parked closer. Choo choo. More rocks, more lava. More side-winding traverse. Hello, that looks like an armature. I can see you in the distance. Yep. Bang. Got something in my inventory. Fine. Nope, oh, hello. Something did damage to me there. I'm not know what it was. Boop. Let's not drive into the lava, shall we? We'll probably be fine, but I don't want to risk it. Stop shooting at me. You're way too far away. I'm sure there's a way to zoom with this cannon, but I can't remember what it is. <laughs> nope. Nope. Oh, there you go. Eh, nerd. What about you? What do you got? Anything? Oh, my angle's funky. Can I just run you over? <laughs> yeah, it's fine. This is your life now. Just back over it. It's fine. Oh, sick jumps over the gunshots. Fucking, how many APCs do you know that can do that? Hmm, is it none? I bet it's none. Yeah, just snipe you out with my fucking machine rival. <laughs> One thing I do love about the Unreal Engine, ragdoll physics. Thank. Oh, I guess Colossus, huh? You tougher than the other ones, are you? Oop. Wrecked. Just collapse. Just flop around. Boink. You're pretty big, actually. Colossus is an appropriate name. 
Still, the Mako doesn't handle super well, but I really like this stuff. Like, it makes the world feel bigger. Like, spoiler alert for Mass Effect 2 and 3, but they didn't include the Mako in those ones. I think that there's a DLC for 3 that lets you, um, play with the Mako again, but... I don't know, I can't remember. It might be 3 or it might be 2 even. Can I run you guys over? I can actually, and you just die. That's handy. Yeah, yeah, they're damaging me and shit. But I've got fucking huge wheels. Meh. <laughs> hey, that looks like... Vaguely like the bacon. Which means cool shit ahoy. Possibly. Or possibly just more tunnels and garbage. Anything interesting over there? Doesn't look like it. Fine. Just do sick jobs all day. More tunnels. Tell you what, though, I am actually kind of running out of time, so... I guess sitting around the tunnel entrance is going to have to be where we leave off this one. Mass Effect is a big game. It's a long game. And that means that it is fairly slow going, so I do apologize if that's really not your cup of tea. But I personally regard it as a challenge. You know, can I LP this, ga LP LP this game in a relatively decent way? I hope so. But uh, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Thank <laughs> you.